Welcome back. In the Fargo Season 5 conclusion, Juno Temple discloses if Dot regrets making one catastrophic error. The season-long survivor's tale of Dot concluded in the breathtaking season finale of FX's Coen Brothers-inspired drama series. Not every character was as fortunate as Dot, who survived the tragedy at Roy Tillman's ranch and was reunited with her family. Lamorn Morris's Whitfar, a state patrolman whose life had earlier been spared by Dot, was among the deceased. He felt obligated to honor her memory by freeing her from Roy's grasp. Though Whitfar lost his life at Roy's hands in the Fargo Season 5 finale, he was successful in helping Dot escape the violent events. This could cause Dot to feel guilty because she failed to end Roy when she had the chance and instead tried to make him suffer before killing him. Actor Temple made some perceptive comments regarding the possibility that her character could feel guilty for Wit's passing. She stated that she believes Dot will feel regret. See what she said as follows. Star of Fargo Juno Temple discussed the meaning of the Season 5 finale sequence, specifically addressing the confrontation between Ole Munch and Dot. One year after leaving Roy's ranch and her ex-husband being taken into custody, Dot is shown being approached by Munch to complete his work. She succeeds in persuading him that there is no obligation to be paid, though, and her generosity causes him to smile for the first time. In an interview with The Hollywood Reporter, Temple discussed the significance of the Fargo season 5 finale and what it implies for Dot and Munch. The actress described how Munch's pre-existing mental state was penetrated by Dot's gesture of kindness, resulting in a joyful ending for both characters. See what Temple had to say about this below, why Fargo Season 5's final moment with Munch makes sense Ole Munch reveals his past in the Season 5 finale, reaffirming that he is, as said in Episode 3, a 500-year-old Sin Eater. He attempts to defend his acts by pointing to his background and saying that it's the only way of life he's ever known, hence, a debt needs to be paid. But Dot is able to break him free from this vicious cycle by telling him that his sin may be washed away by eating with love. In the last scenes of Fargo, Munch comes to the realization that he can live a happy life without accepting a life filled with debt and people owing him money. The scene emphasizes the recurring topic of Season 5, which is that people often feel entitled to certain things even when they are free to choose whether or not to seek them. Roy is a prime illustration of this, without his attempt to entice Dot back to his ranch, which he felt he owed her according to his religious conviction. His life would have carried on as usual. Munch is able to break free from his own 500-year cycle of debt and repayment to others by not chasing his purported debts. In the same way that Dot is now free of her own perceived debt to Roy, this grants him a genuine freedom that he did not have before. The final scene that the two characters experience together in Fargo Season 5 brings the topics the show has been examining to a complete close. For more, subscribe.